Michael Gilmore from Park Logic joins us. Michael, how you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, really good to, to be in here. I must admit, I love this this time every single year at NamesCon. It's great just sitting down and having a chat with you. Yeah, thank you. Uh, likewise, uh, what has you most excited about NamesCon this year? Oh, look, I think NamesCon. Anyone who's anybody in the industry is here. And so I was saying to you a few minutes ago even that I just got like so many meetings coming up, but not only just having meetings for meeting's sake, they're great meetings. And they're gonna give it a, a fantastic result. Yeah, you actually yeah. had a good tip. Uh, you did a cost analysis breakdown per hour. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> which is great. I think more people should do that so they know, you know how many meetings they should set up throughout uh, the day. Maybe it's my MBA hat or something like that. I stick yeah. on, I sort of say, well, uh, whether I'm awake or asleep, it costs me $100 an hour to be here. Yeah, precisely. And that's a good rule of thumb. And therefore, the parties are great, but what's the outcome? Right, right. Yeah. You have to keep your, your mind in the game. Yeah, you, you do have to keep your mind in the game. Yeah. Sure, you, you can have a lot of fun as well in that process. And I always view that when you sit down and speak with someone, the thing that goes through my mind all the time is, what can I do to help them? That's what I'm always thinking about. Can we help this person? Right. And the next thing that goes through my mind is, what can I learn from them? Got it. Because I think in this industry, it moves so fast that as soon as you stop learning, you're dead. I think that goes for any industry too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's adapt or die. Yeah, it's world, exactly so. right, yeah. <laughs> A lot of companies don't do that, they, yeah, they perish. Um, what sort of hot topics do you think are gonna be uh, you know, building at, the, at NamesCon this year? Well, that's a really interesting one. Um, I, Look, there's, there's one of the great things about domain names is they're so flexible. They're like a bowl of jelly, you know? You hit it with a hammer and it sort of just changes shape. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and that's one of the things I really love about domain names is that their flexibility. Um, I think there's, there's some interesting topics on my daughter's going to uh, on social media. Hmm. My, one of my daughters, are here, well, actually both my daughters are here, <laughs> oh, and my great. wife is here, yeah. and uh, she wants to pick up, uh, Sarah wants to pick up all the different sessions on social media related, because she's going to be doing a degree in social media. Oh, that's fantastic. Uh, she's then. starting that this yeah. year. In fact, she's doing some amazing stuff in social media So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. at the moment. But yeah, so I think those topics will be interesting. I think um, there's a tremendous amount of opportunity still in the traffic space. Hmm. Um, a lot of people think it's dead. It's definitely not dead. Um, I, we're doing a lot of work also with registries and registrars. Um, a, a huge amount of work, and we're really expanding into that a lot more as well. Mm. Yep. Okay. I know you, you have a lot of connections in the industry, brokers, other people, yeah. and I know you're a major domain investor. Mm -hmm. Is there any sales from the last year in 2016 that you'd like to share with, with anybody? I know sometimes that you're under NDA, <laughs> but if there's any sales you'd like to share from the past year, you can. Uh, if not, no. it's okay. Yeah. I, can't, <laughs> yeah. I, I can't share those, but okay. um, can I just say though, is that like, even if you're new to the industry, mm. the best place you can possibly go for, to is so, some of the blogs, obviously, and hey, go to my blog, Wizbang's blog, but the other place is Name Pros. And I'm not just saying it because you're from Name Pros. Right. But in case you guys didn't notice yet. <laughs> yeah, 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 but, but getting into Name Pros and becoming a part of the community, the online community, is really important because that's where the deals are done. Mm. And uh, when you come to an event like this, you're then not a stranger, you're, like people know you. Right. Uh, and, uh, and you can get so much business done like that. Like I said, I've got, 22 meetings scheduled right now because mm. people know me and they know that I've been around for like last like, 17 years or whatever it is. And so, yeah. yeah, and it just takes time to get into an industry, but whatever you do, become a part of like a, a, the, the form like name pros. Yeah. yeah, it's a stupendous device. I mean, uh, yeah. people should really take heed of that. Um, even set up me meetings in advance for names cons. You oh. go over name pros or via I, email, I, everything else. Like you're saying, you have 22 set up. Yeah. That's the way to go because you can't organize everything before the event or at the event, I should say. Uh, absolutely not. Like, yeah. I must admit, it normally gets the last day for me, and uh, I have 30 minute meetings. Right. And right. I sort of say, look, I'd love to get to know you, but what's the deal? Yeah. Yeah, it's just and I, I'll get to know you later on. <laughs> it's almost like that. Yeah. Because it's, it's, there's just so much activity here. And one of the things I love about uh, NamesCon is the energy in the place. You mm. can just feel it. Yeah. Like already this morning, I've had a, a great meeting which could potentially like pay for everything. That's what like, you want to hear, yeah. Yeah, and, and, it's, and it's just because, and it's a relationship I've had for like 15 years. Oh, that's great. Yeah, yeah so they're all forged here, re, re enabled correct, here. Correct, yeah, correct. Reinvigorated. Yeah. Um, another question I had for you is uh, a lot of people have 
an issue describing what domain investing is. I figured, go to the experts, oh ask them gosh. how would you describe what domain investing is to an outsider? Yeah, that's an interesting thing. What I always do is I, I, I look on any investment, I look on what's the outcome. Mm -hmm. And I, I sort of say, what's the business model? How am I gonna make money from this? And so when I look at the, the domain industry, there's four main models and uh, of how am I gonna actually make money. So when, I, when you ask what's domain investing, mm -hmm. depends who you are. So mm -hmm. if you're a developer, you may say, well, domain investing is about developing a domain into a business. Or you may say, okay, I'm going to have traffic domains and I'm going to earn money from the traffic they have. Or I'm going to go and buy domains so I can sell them like stock items off a shelf and I sell them for 700 bucks. I buy them for 10 bucks, sell them for $700. Yeah. Or I'm going to go into the premium market and I'll buy a domain for $100,000, hopefully sell it for a million dollars. We so can only hope, yeah. Yeah, so they're the four main models. So I always think, okay, where's my outcome? How am I going to get my return on the investment? And if I don't have that very clear in my mind, then I'm not gonna invest in anything. So those people who sort of say, they, they, it's almost like they fall in love with domains. They go, oh my gosh, I just love my domains. Every one of them's got a little story and stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. I remember when I bought this one, it was like one of my children over here, yeah. <laughs> I'm in love with my bank account. Right, right. And I, I become very pragmatic and uh, about where am I gonna get my, my return on my investment from. Right, we have to make sure we remember that these are assets we're talking about. Yeah. And it's, it is investing, right? It's not a it's hobby, not a it's hobby. investing. That's correct. So you have to keep in mind, do you want the cash or do you want the asset? And that's uh, correct. what do you want to part with? So. Yeah, that's the thing is that, and there's nothing wrong with having a hobby called domaining. Oh yeah, of course. There, there's a lot of people who do, they yeah. just love collecting these things and, they, and all that sort of stuff. And I don't yeah. have a problem with that. Yeah. Me, I'm a business guy and I want to get to how am I going to get my return? Right. And uh, that's what I'm very focused on. So the, I always look at those four business models. So I, I've actually said to people at different conferences along the way, I said, if you want to sell me something, talk about why I should buy it according to the four business models. Mm. And That's then smart. do the pitch in that way, yeah. and then I'll be listening to you. Yeah. If you say, just because it's a really cool domain, and hey, I bought it in this way, and yada, 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 yeah. I don't really care. Right, yeah. <laughs> That's a great advice, honest advice too, because more yeah. people are maybe not saying that to them, and they're losing out on a lot of sales for that reason. Yeah, that's correct. And the, the other thing, I wrote an article in my blog, and I said, don't pitch your hamburger domains at Michelin star prices. Yeah, yeah. And so many people walk away from a deal for 750 bucks, as I think it's a $75,000 domain. No, it's a $750 domain. Right. Just sell Something it. That's, you know, it's 16 characters long. Yeah, it's like, just, just yeah. sell it and move on. Yeah. Like, you just made like 10,000% in your money anyway. Yeah, that's like, unheard of in most industries. That's exactly so, right. Yeah. So, yeah. so just move on because the name of the game is stock turn at that level. Yeah. Is how do I move from a 1% to a 2% stock turn? That's my name. So it's, it's all about transactions. It's not about the value of the transaction. Exactly, exactly right. It's like you're, you're selling washing powder. Yeah, <laughs> that's, yeah, that's, that's what you're doing. You're yeah. not selling Maseratis. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> unless you have those uh, one word dot coms, but that's a whole different, we probably well, don't need to give well, those people the advice, right? That's yeah. a premium domain, yeah. that's different. Yeah, that's exactly. Different. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Yeah, well, thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate it. And I know you it's have a busy great. schedule, 22 meetings. This is number 23, I think. Yeah, yeah, so, <laughs> yeah. No, it's been really good. And can I just say, once again, reiterate, is get involved with name pros. Thank you very much. Yeah, and yeah. people need to do that. Can I just say, it's been fantastic. Yeah, it's been fantastic. Really Thank good. you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Great stuff. Thanks okay, a lot. Thanks, Michael.